At the Geneva Push Network, we are keen to support wives as well as husbands with the challenges of church planting. And I'm wanting to talk to uh, three ladies, Alita, Tanya and Teresa, who are involved in the really early stages of church planting. Uh, talk with them about what they find challenging with church planting, uh, particularly, and also what they have found to be helpful and supportive from the Geneva Network as they begin. Uh, so I'll talk to Alita first. Yeah, for you personally, what's been, I guess, the most challenging thing starting out in a new church? It's been really challenging to work out um, my role and what I should focus my time and energy on. Um, there are so many holes and so many needs and so many things that need doing. Um, it's been really challenging to work out um, what I should put my hand to and what I should um, leave for other people to fill. Yeah, okay. Um, what about for you, Tanya? What's been Yeah, um, my husband's a new minister and so um, we're church planting um, and so I guess my challenge has been learning how to, uh, what that role looks like for him, uh, what my role as a um, church minister's wife looks like, how to best partner with him and support him. Mm -hmm. And Teresa, what have you found challenging? Oh, it's been challenging helping our family to adjust, the kids to adjust, particularly uh, saying goodbye to relationships at our old church. but. Actually learning to invest and, and get to know a whole bunch of new people, lots of new relationships, mm. and that's been quite tiring mm. for us. Now, one of the things that we want to do with the Wives Network is support you and people like you in this. And uh, we've got foundations, um, boot camp, we've got coaching, a uh, bit of network. For you, Alita, what have you found helpful what supported you as you've gone through these early years? I found the Foundations Boot Camp last year really helpful. Um, I think in previous years, everyone does it face to face, but we were on Zoom, which was lovely mm. to get to do it in some way then. Uh, but it was really helpful to go through the material and have that training on at the Foundations Boot Camp. We did focus on, as a pastor's wife, the influence that we do bring and um, what things um, it can be particularly helpful to put our hands to. So it's been helpful to think through that as mm. we're going into and, and starting our church plant to really have a strategic idea in mind of where I might um, want to serve mm -hmm. and my, what my role would be. Mm. What about for you, Tanya? What's been... Uh, so I've found that just in the day-to-day -day, uh, running of everything, uh, new things come up. Um, we're constantly learning and growing and developing um, and trying new things. And so having a community of people, of people that have been there, done that, um, have some wisdom to share. So um, to be able to turn to um, people at Geneva Push and ask them questions. Um, and the most valuable thing I'm finding recently is building this community with each other who are all sharing in the same experience, um, making some friendships of people I can turn to for support or advice. Mm -hmm. um, That's good. It's been yeah. really wonderful. Yeah, good. And Teresa, what's been supportive for you particularly? One of the things that Geneva Push has provided is uh, I guess, access to a coach, even for us wives, and that's been invaluable for me. I've really enjoyed just spending time with um, my coach uh, talking through the issues pretty much as, as they're happening uh, and uh, appreciated those really directed questions where she's challenged me and helped me to think well about those things and pointed me to the to God's word mm, as well. Mm. Yeah. It's good to hear. Yeah, so we're really keen to support wives um, who are planting, uh, but we're actually going to broaden even more now and support all the wives of the guys that do the REACH leadership training course as well. So at the moment, that might be 80 women out there in much the same way. So provide coaches, provide learning um, opportunities, leadership training, um, and a bit of a cohort and a network together to support each other. So that's something that's on the cards we're developing right now. And uh, I think it's been helpful. It's been helpful to, to yeah, support each other, learn from each other and have that encouragement as we serve God in this work. Mm.